now I'm going to do a small decoration on these bonbons. I cut, I cut chocolate. I just do a small, a very small drizzle. When I drizzle this, I like to go with the entire bonbon. I don't like to do, for example, like this. You know, that looks like whatever, you know? If that, if that makes any sense. I like to get the whole thin lines like that. Now this, this is going to go into the freezer, but I'm going to add velvet to this. This is the bonbon that I put chocolate upside down. What happens? What, what am I looking at? I, I look at this moisture, moisture. You see it? So I don't want that because I want to, I want to add velvet. I need to get rid of those bubbles. I don't want those bubbles. Why did you drizzle it before you put the velvet in? Uh, because I want, I want that effect of the lines. I, it's just, I could I think before I velvet and then I do the, the drizzle. I can't recall. But anyways, I, I'm adding a little bit more texture. So to get rid of the bubbles, of those little bubbles, I'm just going to add cold air. I feel moisture coming from here. That's so when you when you okay. Lo tenemos un so I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait about five minutes on that. Do not let me forget my gear class. <laughs> All right, so if I can have your attention, guys, I'm, I'm going to uh, finish the velvet spray on the one, of, one of the bonbons. So, yes, you can do, actually, I can do three minutes, sorry. I mean, I'm not saying that you do it slow, it's just like this is the part that, it goes on these barrels. Yeah, you can buy those. Yeah, you can chatter off. I'm gonna use a different one. You can buy those for like a dollar eighty cents, dollar ninety. It's like Michael's not carrying carry them. No, Michael's won't carry it. You gotta get those straight from Badger. Or you send me an email next week and, and I can sell them to you. Plus I have Badger sprays and sprayers. And uh, all right. All right, so. All right, we can turn around, my friend. Yeah, can you pass it? Any, any bonbons on the two, on the two feet? Thank you. So I'm gonna add it. The velvet finish here. Is that frozen or? Frozen. 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 Yeah. Okay, the same as the white. Same as the white. No, you don't. I like I like the velvet because I like the color of red, and I love the the combination of uh, texture. This definitely you want a ventilation system, you know, because if the cocoa butter gets inside your uh, refrigeration units, it can cause damage. And believe me, I've seen thousands of damage is that because cocoa butter gets to the fan, the things that cool down your, your freezers, then it can, it can force them to work. So it's good to have an extractor. I need to set up my, my glazing station, okay? And uh, I believe I was talking to Jim, Jim yesterday. Uh, so what I have here, 
I have a, a mold. It's just a 27 millimeter mold. It, can, it doesn't have to be 27. It can also be 30, 30 uh, millimeter. Basically, I'm going to take my my truffles, bonbons, however you want to call them. Carefully, I'm going to place them down like that. so that I can pick them up easier as I decorate this. I'm gonna have to wash my hands very well after this because, because of the cocoa butter. Remember, this type of uh, foam material is called polyethylene, okay? Uh, sometimes you get it for free when you order items online or by the phone. I guess it doesn't really matter how you order. But uh, I want to get them all out, ready to go. And then we'll do that effect, the dripping effect that you can do with the, with chocolate. The temperature of the chocolate must be 88. 88 Fahrenheit, okay? So we have this done. Right, you can put this somewhere else. I'm gonna put this, start my mix and plus station here. I'm gonna set it over here. Then uh, I need to take, uh, part, uh, Chocolate. We have a fresh bag of chocolate. Fresh. A fresh one. Like one cup of chocolate should be sufficient for this. So this is just to maintain the chocolate uh, in temper, you know. Then I will place this here, or also this way, like that, okay? But before I do it, I will show you, yes, it clean, super clean, this and not all of those. On the bottom, there's three more. Get them very clean and dry them, and then put those, Jesse, on that table in the middle, okay? I'm gonna put, as I finish the bonbons, I'm gonna put them there so we can take a, a good photo. So ideally, you want to do this, uh, if you have access to a walking cooler, do it there. All right, so what we do is this. We take one. Then just hold it and gently do this, okay? Then you bring this carefully and set over here this way, see? So I will do, I'm sorry to give, give my back to you. No worries, it's okay. We're not filming right now. Good. <laughs> then, Carmen, you want to come and do this? Or actually, if anybody wants to do, I'll do two. You, come on, Jim. So I want to, I want you to see, I pull it. Don't put too much and keep it straight down. You just have to have sort of a, a handy, uh, steady hand. So there you go. And you pass them to me. Then I place them over here. Just make sure you don't, don't move it, exactly. 